Hey guys. Well, today's video is on uh, Viper goggles for the uh, Mavic Pro FPV flying. Stay tuned for that. And then uh, I'm, I'm uh, Colette. I'm looking for you. I have something here for you. Let me just show you what it is here. I have a paracord bracelet here for you in yellow with a pink um, bead on here and that's the adjustable part you can close it up to whatever size of wrist you have tie these back in when you're ready or open it up so that you can put it on your wrist so you need to what you need to do Colette is uh, in the description below you'll see my uh, email address there and just email me with uh, how I could get this to you either by mail or whatever method we can work out I have a bracelet here for you all right guys today before we get into the video I've got a couple of shout outs to do um, two new members of power saw I've got uh, Southpaw RC. I'll put a link up above. Great channel. Go check him out, guys. Newest member of Power Saw. And then we have Robbie Will Survive, the next newest member of Power Saw. So, guys, we've got two new members of Power Saw to put into the club. And uh, I guess let's get on with the video. All right, guys, made a purchase of a Viper goggles, uh, FPV goggles for the Mavic Pro. I did uh, set it all up. I'll show you some footage here of um, flying with the uh, uh, the goggles. Uh, cool experience, like especially with uh, with the Mavic. Um, I needed. I still need to use the 10 inch tablet that I have with it because my phone does not have uh, an HDMI output so I needed something with HDMI output so I can input to the goggles HDMI so I found I my tablet did have HDMI output uh, wires to the to the goggles and then the the, the uh, goggles are reflective there's a couple of mirrors in there uh, the the monitors up here reflects on a mirror mirror back and it's beautiful I'll show you the footage here and I'll show you the, the goggles um, it's quite a different experience than looking at the tablet now the reason I, I like this a lot is because the tablet I've tried every kind of co coating I've tried every kind of coating that you could put to stop the reflection from happening in the background a mat, a, a, all kinds of different uh, coverings that didn't do anything. I've even had a box built, cardboard box that had a hole in it. Now that worked, where I could put my eyes. Uh, now that worked, but any kind of a shield would not work because it reflects from behind you, not from up above or from the sides. So when you're holding it like this, what you're seeing is yourself and especially if you're looking down more you see sky blue sky white uh, clouds whatever is up there the, you can't see anything even if the uh, tablets on as bright as it can go it's just uh, not good so the goggles make up for that and they're beautiful so I'll show you some footage here guys the Viper goggles okay guys I got the drone set up here you can't really see it too well in the darkness I've got my tablet here. Uh, you can see the camera is pointing directly at the, the owl there and the teddy bear. And here is my goggle screen display. So we can see the latency at all. I don't think there's any. This is going to be great. Okay, let's stop the let's put the camera, uh, drone down. Stop the video. 
Let's have a look at the new Viper goggles I've got. Get this in the sun a little more so we can see. That's the screen there. Uh, it has this piece here for the nose that comes off. Okay, guys, let's see if I can get you to see inside the goggles here. I can now see the screen. Just the way I see it on my tablet. So, let's go for a flight, guys. I need to. Okay, I know I look as goofy as ever, guys, but this is it. These are the Viper goggles. And I'm going to try to record video from within. I'm not too, too sure, but this is uh, my old setup here. Well, not the old. This is what I was using, um, uh, the tablet. But as you can see, nothing but reflection. And I've tried all different kinds. Of, there's a mat on there right now. But, uh, okay, guys, let's get this bird up and flying. What's nice about these goggles, I have a side... I have another piece that goes on that covers the side there, so I, um, but I can still wear glasses on the inside. So I took that part off. You can either wear it either or, off or on. So I took it off right now. It's good. Okay, guys, let's go for a flight. <laughs> 